Hey guys, it's me, Amy, with A Taylor AI One. I'm gonna try to get through this as quickly as possible, so bear with me. I had done basically three lists of couponing that I was gonna do today. I'm gonna show you what I did. It was not all with coupons, but give you an overview about how I shop and what I buy. Um, I'm always fascinated to see you guys in your videos about your hauls and as well as about what you just buy normally to feed your family. Now Walgreens is where we're going to start off today. The Cottonelle is normally $5 for either the wipes. These are normally 6 These are marked for 5 this week. Um, a flushable uh, cleansing cloth. No, don't mind me. Yeah. Okay. So, that was our little timeout, wasn't it? Anyways, this is one dispenser and 42 cloths in here. On sale for five. A $1 in ad uh, coupon in the monthly booklet, which you can find at the front of the store. I'm not going to go get the one that I have. It's on page 12. There's one for the wipes and one for the Cottonelle. So that would make each of these $4 each. Then there was in the Smart Source on 811 a 50 cent to a $1 um, coupon. My area only got the 50 cent coupons. If yours has the dollar, hey, you're doing really good. So for me, um, the Cottonelle minus the $1 in-ad coupon as well as the two, because you have to buy two at a time, um, to get the Catalina that's going to print, which is a $2 Catalina. So let's back up and let me retract. Go back over it. You buy two of the toilet papers. They're $5 each. That would be $10 um, total. Then you take off $2 for the in-store coupon. You only need one booklet. One coupon will deduct $2. Um, that's going to be $8 if you had to pay right then and there. But I had two 50 cent manufacturer coupons. That meant out of pocket was $7. Even. Okay, and then I got a $2 Catalina. Some people like to say, well, I only paid $5. Or... Two fifty each. So if that's the way you want to think of it, that's fine. For me, I think of it as that I paid seven dollars uh, for two of them, and that is going to be three dollars and fifty cents each. And then I have two dollars to carry over. I did try to buy the Cottonelle toilet paper in one wipe in a transaction that did not produce the Catalina. You have to buy two wipes or two of the 12-pack Catalina toilet papers, either type. There's the blue one and a purple one. You can interchange the purple and the blue as far as the toilet paper, but you can't do that with the wipes. The wipes and the toilet paper each stand alone, if that makes any sense. Also, the Catalina is not rolling. I did try to use a $2 Catalina to pay for the transaction, it did not produce another Catalina, okay? I did try it, by the way, I did the math for if you bought four at one time, and if you bought three at one time, the best um, ending price was the 250 If you took off the $2 Catalina, the first two at a time works best. I used what was left of the $6 to buy me two things of pistachios, which is my all-time favorite snack, and some chapstick. So I don't have anything left to roll at Walgreens, which is fine by me. Now here, I have our Kroger haul. Hang on, I'll be right back. Okay guys, so this is uh, the Kroger haul. Now I'm going to show you. I used eCoupons off of Kroger.com, just so that you're aware. I actually only had um, 
three paper coupons and that came off of these. These are $1.99. They have 50 cent coupons on them and they doubled to a dollar making these 99 cents each or 50 cents for each tub of tuna salad. Not too bad of a deal there. Everything else was e-coupons. Um, there was actually a paper coupon for this and I forgot it was in my pocket and it's 55 cents off and this is a dollar 99 which made it like a dollar um, 40 something so anyways um, mushrooms of course you always have to have mushrooms some strawberries some bananas corn on the cob snap uh, green peas or sugar snap peas some large curd cottage cheese um, these here had a e-coupon on Kroger.com for a dollar off. They're $1.99. And that made these 99 cents. Uh, the Hot Pockets, um, they were $2.50 each. You buy four, you got a $2 e-coupon off. You know, if you selected it. So that's what I got those. Cascadian Farm Cereal, which is my son William's favorite and also mine. $2.99 had a $2 coupon when you bought two, so that was $4 or $2 each. The General Mills, of course, everyone's been hearing about the $6 uh, e-coupon. Um, you buy four of the Big G cereals. They have to be the ones that are $3.49 each, which is the family size. Okay, okay guys, that would be um, $1.99 each. I think that I have the wrong thing written there for that. Um, the big big G cereals are going to be a dollar ninety nine, which is not a bad price for the family size. Normally, it's the smaller ten ounces <coughs> that we would get for a dollar. <coughs> Excuse me. The Kellogg's was two ninety nine. If you bought two, there was a dollar fifty e coupon off of two for those. Um, the Jack's pizzas were $3.19 each. You were supposed to get a $3 Catalina, but their site is down. And for some reason, all I got was a $1 Catalina. I also did get the uh, 26 Kool-Aids, which gave the $2 uh, back. But you have to buy regular flavors. If it says new flavor on it, it will not work towards the Catalina. Um, roast beef, one of the boys' favorite for making sandwiches. I got bacon. That's just some more Hot Pockets because we bought like eight of them. Ground veal, ground, ground, uh, ground veal and ground lamb. Flour tortillas, anything you want your kids to eat something, put it on a flour tortilla. Guaranteed they'll eat it. If you bought two crafts, there was an e-coupon for $2 off, and these were $3, and I don't know if that coupon is still there, but it was an e-coupon for two off, and these were $3.19 each. Um, you always have to buy chicken, or at least we do, because we love it. This is $4.49, roasted garlic, tomato, and basil. Um, cheese, some Gouda, which I happen to love. I wanted to try this, which was just tuna uh, turnovers. There's six of them, and it was like three dollars. Chopped ham. There was a dollar off of any one pound, which this is a one pound of Oscar Mayer e coupon, and this is my favorite luncheon meat. Eh, the other hot pockets, and then cordon bleu. Um. $4, and this will serve my lunch for two days uh, this week. Uh, hamburger Helpers, it was four for five. If you buy four and you have the coupon for a dollar off, it makes them four for four dollars, um, which is actually kind of a normal price. Some raw shrimp tails off, peeled and deveined. Some crab legs, which are always my favorite. Y'all know that. Um some Kroger dressing it was a dollar off this was 209 so I got it for a dollar nine 
There was 25 cent Hunt's tomato ketchup e-coupon. This was a dollar, so that made it 75 cents. The uh, Kraft Classic Ranch was $2.50, and there was an e-coupon for, I think, $0.50 cents or something like that, so that came off. And then I got, I think I already mentioned the cottage cheese, but if I didn't, I will. And then five things of, of corn, five for a dollar. Grapes, Kikimon had an e-coupon for a dollar off. It was two oh nine, so that was a dollar nine. This was a dollar ninety nine, but it had a fifty five cent coupon on it. And the butter did not have coupons. And then I bought this because I just love this stuff. If you've never tried this with your kid, and it's four bucks, but you just blow it and it makes like these big balloon bubble thingies that I don't know. I like playing with them. Did I tell you about the Jack Pizzas? I'm going to assume I didn't. You buy three of them, you're supposed to get a $3. I only got a $1, and these were $3.19 each. Walgreens has a little bit better of a deal. A, a $3.99 for two, and then you get one free, and then you should get a Catalina back. So, here is my receipt. And this is a normal shopping trip. Even though I usually don't buy this many, but the boys will have cereal when I'm not here, so that's a good thing. So I saved almost 30% or $77.53, and it was all e-coupons. Oh, the eggs, real quick. The eggs are $0.88 cents each. I usually buy the 18-pack. That was $1.99. Um... It was cheaper to buy two 12 packs or dozen, two dozen eggs, seven cents an egg, as opposed to an 18 pack, which would have been 11 cents per egg. So always check that in case I didn't tell you. The Capri Sun was $2 and there was a dollar e coupon, so that made it basically like a dollar. So this is it, guys. The boys are wanting to eat the pizza. Oh, the bread, of course. That was like a dollar. So, that's our haul. Alright guys, live, love, and eat. Bye.